What's up my fellow trainers? My name is Mark and welcome back to Trainer Mark, the channel where we open Pokemon cards together. I'm back with another awesome video for you guys, but today we're surprisingly not going to open what we're typically used to, which is Hidden Fates, Team Up, or Unified Minds. We're going to take a little break and open up Shining Legends instead. So this is a little bit of a throwback. This is a somewhat recent set, but not that new. It came out a little while ago but it's kind of a mini Hidden Fates set where it features some awesome shiny legendary Pokemon. So we're gonna see if we can pull any on today's opening. Specifically, the two products that we'll be opening are two Mewtwo pin collections. And it's funny because Hidden Fates also has a Mewtwo pin collection. So each of these are similar. They come with a holographic Mewtwo promo, as you can see, a pin and three Shining Legends packs. So let's see what we can get inside when we open them up. And quick uh, piece of info, I found these at Walmart. They're on clearance, so if you're lucky enough to find them at your Walmart, definitely uh, pick them up. But the clearance price is actually not that much better than the list price. I think regularly these are $15 each, but the clearance price is I think $13 or $12. So it's only a few bucks off, but I was surprised to see them there. So I thought I'd pick them up and open the packs for you guys. Uh, last thing, there is a giveaway going on right now on this channel for a chance to win this awesome Legendary Birds promo card from the Hidden Fates Elite Trainer Box. And all you have to do to enter this giveaway for a chance to win this card for free is to like this video, subscribe to this channel, Trainer Mark, and tell me in the comments below which one of those three Legendary Birds is your favorite. Is it Moltres, Zapdos, or Articuno? And that will enter you in to possibly win that beautiful card. All right, guys, thank you for joining me on today's opening. And without further ado, let's jump into these two pin collections. They are identical. So I'll just start with opening this one up. As you can see, there's a, a clearance sticker on it, uh, indicating that it is on clearance, but it's kind of annoying because it doesn't show the price. So you kind of have to do your research or find a, a, an employee to help you out with that. Also, these are really beat up, the boxes. There's like all sorts of creases and white, whitening on the side and the edges. So I'm hoping that these boxes aren't tampered with, which means that somebody opened it up, opened the pack, and then put it all back together and returned it. But um, it is Walmart, so... And as most of us know, stuff happens at Walmart. Like crazy stuff happens, so... Uh, maybe... These are brand new and they just look really worn because so many people are, are putting their hands on them. But anyways, here is the Mew pin for you guys to look at. It's very cool. I think I actually like this one a little better than the Hidden Fates one. So there's that. Here is the promo card. Very cool looking Mewtwo. Awesome artwork. And of course, inside we have our three Shining Legends packs, which I have not seen in a long, long time. It's I got a shiny Genesect on there, a shiny Mew, and a shiny Rayquaza. And if we pull a shiny Pokemon today, you will see that these cards are actually very different than the shiny GXs that we see in Hidden Fates, because these shiny Pokemon actually have uh, a name that says Shining Blank. So like Shining Genesect, Shining Mew, Shining Rayquaza. It actually says on the card. So that's kind of neat and different. So, um, all right, let's start with the uh, Shiny Genesect. Why don't we open this up? Wow, these packs are really loose feeling. Okay, well, I'm really hoping to pull like something good so that I don't have to be worried about these packs being uh, searched already in the turn because that is like every Pokemon card collector's worst nightmare. So really hoping that's not the case and that's just really awful to do that. So we got a Pikachu, a Jinx, really happy Jinx. Oh, sorry. Cards are really uh, sticking together to get today. A uh, Shroomish. Minin, Quillfish, pretty angry. Our reverse is a Palkia, which is a rare actually, so that's really cool. And our rare for the pack is, oh my gosh, 
<laughs> what an awesome start. We got a rainbow rare full art Raichu GX and our fears are relieved because no pack searcher would ever leave this card in the pack and then return the product. So we have brand new sealed packs of Shining Legends today, guys, to open up. So super excited now uh, to not have to worry about that, but also that we pulled this beautiful, beautiful card. The vibrancy of the rainbow and the texture is like almost better than uh, some of the cards that they're making in current sets right now, so. That is a nice rainbow rare. We will be setting that Raichu aside to do a recap at the end of the video, like we always do. So stick around for that. And let's finish off the pack. We got a Fairy Energy, Float Soul, Carnivine, and a Switch. Whoa, the code card's backwards. Is that normal? All right. Cool. Well, that was a great pack. Why don't we move on to the one featuring Shiny Mew? And there is a Shiny Mew in this set to pull. So that's really cool. And Mew is definitely one of my favorite Pokemon. So maybe Mew will make an appearance in today's video. Uh, Bulbasaur. Ivysaur. Wait. Oh, Ivysaur is a common as well. So both Bulbasaur and Ivysaur are common. Like, how is that possible? We got both of those. Stunfisk. Totodile. The reason why I'm pulling them off this way is because it's kind of hard to swipe up on the cards. They're kind of glossy. Litten. Making sure not to damage it. Voltorb. And our rare is... Oh cool, we got the Palkia again, except this time we got the regular version, which is a holographic rare, Palkia. Very cool. And because it's called Shining Legends, it means that there's a lot of legendary Pokemon featured in this set, which is always a good time. That's cool for Alligator. Huh, looks like all the code cards are backwards, so. Fine by me. Last pack for this pin collection. Wow, so we got a, a rainbow rare and a, uh, a holographic rare so far. So pretty good pulls in this blister pack or this uh, pin collection so far. Minin, Larvesta, Torkoal, Ivysaur, Zorua, chillin'. Our reverse hollow is a warp energy, uncommon card. And our rare for the pack is, nice, a holographic Caldeo. Very cool, so we got three hollows technically. One in every single pack. Actually, wait, I think Shining Legends actually has a hollow in every pack guaranteed. So that's why this is happening. Oh, I was hoping it was because we were super lucky or something, but nope. I believe every pack comes with at least one holographic rare, so that's normal. All right, cool. Let's move on to the uh, the second Mewtwo pin collection for another three packs to open up. I can manage to... Yep, the box is... It's a goner. Okay. Open that up. Mewtwo pin, promo, and our three Shining Legends packs. Here they are. We got the same artworks as the last, uh, the last pin collection box. Why don't we start with the Genesect again? And uh, maybe we'll pull one of the shining Pokemon that are in Shining Legends in this in this box. I'd love to show you guys uh, what those look like, especially if you haven't seen them before. They're really nice. Uh, Croconaw. Jinx, P 
Pikachu, Ekans, Toracat, stuck. Our reverse hollow is a Voltorb. And our rare is a Shining Genesect in the Shining Genesect pack, guys. So that just worked out really nicely. Uh, we pulled our first shiny Pokemon, and it is a Shining Genesect. Very, very cool. So as you can see on the Pokemon title, it says Shining Genesect on it instead of just saying Genesect, which is not the case in Hidden Fates. And uh, not the whole picture is hollow, as you can see right here is not hollow, but in the Pokemon uh, art, the Pokemon itself is textured, embossed, and fully holographic in its red alternate coloration. So that is a Shining Genesect, guys, and it is a beautiful card from the Shining Genesect pack. Wonderful pull right there. Spiritomb. Double Colorless, Sophocles, and a code card so that you guys might be able to pull your own Shining Pokemon as well. Let's move on to the Shiny Rayquaza pack. Um, but we got our first Shining card, and that's pretty sweet. So, good couple boxes that we picked up here. Ivysaur. Stunfisk, Totodile, Litten, Purloin, a reverse, I believe. Yes, it's a great ball. And our rare for the pack is a holographic Palkia again. So a, a duplicate. But we do get a hollow in every pack, which is very cool. And these are all looking really familiar. Super scoop up. Code card. All right, here's the last pack for today's opening. I think we already pulled some pretty amazing stuff, um, but let's still hope for some last pack magic. I believe the rarest and most valuable card in Shining Legends is the Laboratory Mewtwo, which is a full art alternate reprint card of Mewtwo GX, I believe, and or EX, I forget. And the art is just amazing on that card. But it is definitely a secret rare. And therefore, it is quite rare. Purloin. Our reverse is a great ball. And our rare is a holographic Manaphy. Nice card. Another legendary Pokemon. Blessings of the Deep. Cool move. Leaf Energy, Damage Mover, Ultra Ball. A Venusaur that is an uncommon card. That's really weird. It's not a rare. And then our last code card. All right, guys. Let's go through the recap of these six Shining Legends packs and see what we got in today's opening. We got a Manaphy, a Palkia, a Shining Genesect. Definitely one of the highlights of today's opening. We got a shiny Pokemon. Keldeo. Palkia. And our very first pack, which yielded a Rainbow Rare Full Art Raichu GX. Beautiful card. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed that opening of Shining Legends, especially if you haven't seen those cards before. Uh, hopefully um, I can get some more so that we can open up uh, more cards on this channel from this particular set. But thank you so much for joining me on today's opening. And uh, make sure to enter the giveaway for a chance to win this awesome card if you haven't already. And I appreciate all your support and you sticking around and seeing what cards we added to our collection today. Until next time, as always, take care and peace out.